Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, you see, one of the problems we have in this country, Nigeria, is that uh, we don't know how to accept election results just the way it is. PDP, as well, would have accept defeat and congratulate the winner of the election. Uh, election is not a must that you must win. If you contest, there must be one winner. And now, it is obvious that uh, the APC has won this election. You see, the same process that brought Obaseki to power, he was celebrating 2020. Oh, he has control room. They monitored everything. Blah, blah, blah. He won. He did not say there was rigging that time. He never complained. Now that the electoral process is not in your favor, you are complaining here and there. You are crying foul. You are crying wolf. Simply because the election result is not in your favor. You see, one of the problems we have come to, you know, infuse into our system as a people is to just believe that every election must be rigged. Mm. I see a lot of people coming out to say, hey, they, they don't rig election. Hey, they don't rig election. Hey, they don't rig election. Ladies and gentlemen, if you know the rig election, where are the evidences of the rig election? You cannot just speculate something that there are no substantial evidence to back up. Now, let me tell you, and I will tell you for good, one of the reasons why PDP lost this election is simple. Number one, on election day, it rained in Edo South. First, there are some people that cannot enter rain to go and vote, no matter what you tell them. Not that it's not in their mind to vote, but that rain discouraged some persons from going. That is one. Then two, everybody who came out to vote that day, it is not everybody that came out with the intention to vote for PDP for heaven's sake. Some came out to vote for APC. Some came out to vote for Labour Party and some other parties who were involved in the election. Then, three, in APC, I mean, in PDP stronghold, where they forget strong uh, power, local government where they for solid, APC followed the dragon to the latter. But in the local government where they are not solid, like the Edo North, APC wipe everywhere because where they don't have a stronghold there, there is no PDP person in Edo North that can deliver Edo North for PDP. Is he a mobile? Or? That one is a baby politician. You understand? The strong forces in Edo North, Philip Shaibu, Oshomole, Danobi, who support, especially Danobi and Philip Shaibu, who who Obasaki is supposed to keep in their camp no matter what and just prepare them, you know, re -re them, make friendship with them, do mumu, follow them to make sure that he has a stronghold in the do not. He brought the relationship he had with them. The election is not rocket science. It's all about calculation. Then in the Edo Central, the same thing. There is no strong force there. And the vote was also divided. So what are we not talking about yet? You are seeing the result that is declared. People are shouting rigi or so. As well as that, accept defeat and congratulate the winner of the election. And like I said, in Nigeria, if election did not favor a certain person, he will say they rig it. But when he favor you, you can never say they rig it. That is why Samo de Edo said in one of his songs, or where I had the GP. Never. You, when you are progressing, you don't go to the native daughter to consult the oracle to ask, ah, oracle, why am I progressing? No, it is when the progress is not trying to reverse. You cannot start looking for prophet and native daughter. I had the GP. Now, to the Mari of Bunaya, no, was your Naya Magbe. APC have won the election. They have won the election. And if you feel you are not satisfied with the election result, Brother man, you have a law firm. A bawo, you would have law firm. Gather all the lawyers there. You have colleagues in the law industry. Gather them. Go to court. And if your evidence are substantial, you know, because you people have been ranting on media, they rig it, they are manipulating results, they are this, they are that. You have not been able to bring any substantial evidence to back up your claim. Yesterday, now, governor went to Ennek. If you want to go quick, you know, um, influence them. To utter results for in favor. But thank God people were there to chase him out and he left that place shamefully. Uh, what's his name? What's his name? What's his name? Uh, Honorable Matthew Doekeme. That has lit you honor. Uh, he has lit you honor. He still went there yesterday. He shouted up and down. 
or guy your time in the do politics have expired. Are you one who are total? Why are we see you? 